Hey YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and everybody on my Facebook. Um, my name is Sean. Um, I am a biker and I ride motorcycles. And today, I'm going to show you what bikers typically wear. This is a uh, disclaimer. I am not a sport bike rider, so what you see may not necessarily be what sports bike riders wear. Um, this is a general video on what bikers would wear, okay? So let's go ahead and get into it. You're going to see a couple things. A helmet, gloves, jacket, pants, um, eye protection, sometimes hair and protection, and when the elements are out, the rain, okay? So let's get up into it. Okay, first and foremost, let's talk about your head. Your head is the most important part of being a biker, okay? Because if you don't have a head, you can't ride, you can't see, you can't do none of that, okay? So, you have to have a helmet. And according to the state law of Virginia, it must be DOT approved. That means Department of Transportation approved, okay? There's many different styles of helmets. Now, I unfortunately cannot show you all the styles, but let's get into a few, okay? So, right off the bat, this is called a full face helmet, okay? It covers your head, the back of your head, the side of your head, and also nine times out of 10, it will protect your chin and your face, okay? Hence why there's cushions here, okay? Let me make a warning here. If any of this gear is worn improperly, it will not protect you as it is designed for, okay? If you don't have your visor down, it will not protect you if you fall and scrape your face. If your chin strap ain't attached, it will not save you and will fly off, okay? These parts are critical to the way it's designed, okay? So again, this is my full face helmet. Okay, as you can tell, there is padding all around the inside of my helmet. Okay, there is a chin strap which is buckled and then restrained on that red snap here so that it's not flailing around as I ride. Okay, this is what is called a uh, photochromatic visor, which I think is the correct um, word for it in um, helmet lingo, okay? As you can tell, this is a transition lens visor. This visor in the sunlight, okay, will change color to allow me to avoid having these, okay? Because inside here it will fog up. So you use these to prevent that. Now in indoors, my visor changes back to clear. So when you ride at night, you won't have to worry about your visor being all, you know, um, dark and being hard to see, okay? Now, let's go to another form. This is called a half helmet, okay? You have uh, maybe um, one quarter or... Um, yeah, no, this is the half helmet. I'm sorry. It is correct. Okay, so every helmet that is um, okay to use will have a DOT sticker on it. That means you are legally allowed to ride with this helmet. Okay, the DOT does not condone nor suggest riding with certain helmets, but it must be DOT approved. Okay, now as you can tell, there is lining all around this helmet okay, to protect the head, all right? This is the chin strap on the helmet, okay? It closes in with straps, a strap system, okay? And then to open it, you just undo it like that, okay? So there you go, that is a half helmet. So you got your half and you got your full, okay? You guys see the difference? 
This is not required, but this next piece